hello good morning good morning um this morning i just want us to say something in the book of psalms 27 he said the lord is my light and my salvation whom shall i fear the lord is the stronghold of my life of whom shall i be afraid when the wicked advance against me to devour me it is my enemies and my foes who will stumble and fall though an army beseech me my heart will not fear though war breaks out against me even then will i be confident one thing i ask of the lord this is what i seek that i may dwell in the house of the lord all the days of my life that i may dwell in the house of the lord all the days of my life where do you like to dwell is it in the cruel world there or in the house of the lord when you are in the house of the lord you are safe you are protected please my dear people pray for the thing that god has saved you unknowingly the one that god fight your spiritual and physical battle because we don't have to keep silence any longer we don't have to keep silence because now it's not before that you will hear that so they have killed someone dead after some years again before you hear that someone is dead after some years again you know because I remember my grandma would say, ah, somebody died that and yesterday. Then you will stay again like some 10, 15 years before you, 20 years before you hear another day. You will be surprised, you will be shocked. But today, it's been coming like we are living in a slaughterhouse. So please, try always to dwell in the house of the Lord, in the assembly of the believers, in the assembly of the saints, so that God will save and protect you and your entire family and your entire generation. Father, I come before you with this, my family, Lord. I know it is not easy these days, Lord. We come with all our totality and deposit in your hands. Father, we pray. You say in the book of Psalms 125, you say, As the mountains surround Jerusalem, so the Lord surrounds his children. Father, you say you protect your children going out and they are coming in. Father, fight for your children. You say in Psalms 121, you say, The sun will not harm you by day, nor the moon by night, because the Lord will protect you from all harm. Father, protect your children. We know we are stubborn. We do not listen to your word. We do not listen to you, God. Fight for us, spiritually and physically. Father, we are sinking today we don't even know where we are sinking and heading to we don't know where the world is going to god fight for your children fight for our children that they are going out there and being encountered with different kind of spiritual forces we ourselves going to our working place other places that we don't even know getting encounter with different different kind of spirit that we don't even know where they are coming from where they are going lord we pray that may you protect us from their hands in the mighty name of jesus father fight for us do not keep silence because we are already in in trouble father help us and hold us with your righteous right hand in jesus mighty name amen god bless you and have a wonderful start for the day i say my sister marima but from another mother thank you